Uh, hello Cal, we're just talking today about, about getting a service done on, on a watch on say like an automatic watch like a Rolex Datejust what does a service actually involve there? Well a service or what is quite often referred to as a complete overhaul or overhaul is the complete strip down of the movement inside the watch uh, also the case and bracelet are also attended to both cleaned and all the seals are replaced, necessary seals and the band is repaired if necessary the overhaul itself is a stripping down of every single part that's involved in the movement. Um, starting from the dial and hands, taking that off through to the calendar if it's got one, automatic mechanism or chronograph mechanism if it has one, and then right down to the, the heart of the movement which is the balance of the train wheels and uh, the mainspring and so forth. Uh, all, all, sorry, all those parts have to be um, uh, put through a special uh, cleaning process, assembled, lubricated in the right manner, and then adjustments need to be made for timing and also um, uh, spacing and uh, clearances. Now Carl, if you've got a, a quartz watch, does a quartz watch need a service or do they just need a battery change? Quartz watches, um, the good thing about quartz watches is, the one good thing, they only need servicing when uh, the something actually goes wrong with the watch apart from the battery. They do need regular battery changes, generally about two years. Uh, and the seals, or like any watch, need to be changed regularly. Uh, we recommend seals on any watch be looked at every 12 months, and that's regardless of what depth the um, uh, the case is rated at. Now, Carl, as far as a a chronograph compared to say like a a uh, automatic watch, is is that a much bigger service, or or is or is it or is it basically the same thing? Yeah, a chronograph is a much more complicated style of movement. Um, as well as the time function, and you also might have a calendar function. Um, quite often they, they've got the automatic uh, bridge and, and, and setting uh, function on there as well. And then you've got almost an, a, a enough parts to make up another watch just for the chronograph section. Uh, it's quite a complicated um, uh, repair to do, and it takes a lot of uh, fine adjustments and a lot of thorough checking uh, when you're both assembling and disassembling. And Carl, have you worked on many complicated watches yourself there? Yes, I've worked on many different complications, right from uh, uh, the basic ones, the automatics, the calendar watches, right through to uh, chronographs, both mechanical, auto wind, uh, moon phase watches, and the like, repeaters, and so forth. Now Carl, did you also handle pocket watch and clock repairs? I handle pocket watches. Um, of all right from the vi uh, vintage ones, the antique styles, right through to some of the more modern um, uh, pocket watches. And uh, with clocks, I do the quartz clocks. At okay. this stage, we're not um, we're not looking at the mechanical clocks due to uh, space more, more more than anything. Thanks very much for your time, Carl.